45, Clark County Sheriff Gene Kelly opening up for the first time since losing re-election. Good evening, everyone. I'm Deborah Lynn. And I'm Matt Navarro. Kelly lost his seat after 30 years to Deborah Burchett by about 5,000 votes in a shocking upset. Fox 45's Kelly May live down in Clark County with what he had to say about all this. Kelly? Clyde Mendever, he worked here for 30 years, so obviously he was a bit upset about that election results. And he said it's been a difficult month, but he's ready for what's next. I caught up with him at a charity event where he also had some news about his staff and about the incoming sheriff. I am going to move forward. He's been Clark County's top law enforcer for nearly three decades, but in his off time, Sheriff Gene Kelly is also a licensed auctioneer, tonight raising money for the Second Harvest Food Bank. This is a pick-me-up. It's been a very difficult month, and uh, you know I haven't met one person yet that didn't vote for me, so I don't know where those votes came from. Tonight, he opened up for the first time about election night and the surprise loss. For 29 years and nine months, I've parked in the same spot. I've gone into those double doors at the sheriff's office. It's going to be a drastic change, but I know that another door is going to open, and I'm ready for that. He was sheriff when Deputy Suzanne Hopper was ambushed, shot, and killed. He brought to light the impact of heroin addiction on Clark County families. I have 30 years in my office. I have 30 years of files, memorabilia, uh, letters, and I have all of that to clean out. He says he's been asked to write a book. He's thought about teaching, but that he won't stay employed at the Clark County Sheriff's Office. I can't. Everybody in my top staff is now unemployed. They have all lost their jobs. That's politics. He hasn't talked to the former employee, Deb Burchett, who will take his place. I have not. I can't, unless I have my body camera on. But he has thought about continuing charity work. I don't work in the mediocrity. Compared to his day job, it's a piece of cake. There are people who came here tonight just to see me and give me a hug, and that's what keeps me going. Back out your line. We're not sure yet what day Sheriff Kelly will make his last day here in Clark County. Deborah Burchett, though, will be sworn in on December 28th, and then her first day here will be on January 2nd. For now, live in Clark County tonight, Kelly May Fox, 45 News. All right, Kelly, thank you. Well, we reached out to incoming Sheriff Deborah Burchett tonight after Sheriff Kelly's statement on his staff losing their jobs. She said she wouldn't be firing anyone, adding most of Sheriff Kelly's staff can retire and that an incoming sheriff has the right to bring in their own administration, which she plans to do. Burchett also said she would be open to meeting with Kelly, but stated that's up to him. Meantime, that